we are currently viewing um, the work we are doing on the um, master clock, Siemens master clock type UH20 um, slash 48 or similar 9U and then SK2021 slash 15 slash M. Um, this watch was uh, regularly used in the telephone exchange services of the Dutch PTT. Um, they were actually two um, master clocks. Uh, the Germans call it Mutter Uhr. And um, these clocks um, can provide signals uh, to so called slave clocks, Tochter uh, Uhr. And the arrangement down on the right uh, was formerly meant for synchronization on to the master signals uh, originating from the uh, PTT uh, technical headquarters, the so-called uh, Dr. Nea laboratory in Leitzendam. And when you uh, be patient for uh, 30 seconds or so, um, you will see the a typical upwards winding of the clock. And that is initiated for uh, uh, some clicks after um, the um, uh, uh, the um, second uh, uh, pointer is reaching zero and then you will hear um, a succession of clocks I once counted it was 17 and um, you will see down um, the, the normal weight which is being used when the uh, power actually fails we encountered a problem that the the wire uh, which is being wound around a drum um, was for whatever reasons not sufficient so um, it could not reach its uh, uh, most uh, um, down position but more importantly it was winding up when even uh, the, um, the, um, the counterweight is actually a far, uh, nearly inside the clock mechanism, which means that um, the wire is uh, too short for its purpose. It uh, apparently had been once uh, replaced because the clock originates from the 1950s. So um, uh, it is a wire, a nylon by the way, which is in fact also um, being forced by mechanical um, um, usage.